My name is Natalie, if you don't already know. So for today's video, I decided to do a little bit of like a challenge kind of video. Basically what I did was spending $100 at Goodwill and then spending $100 at Urban Outfitters and see how much I could actually get at each place. That's basically it. That's like the whole video, that's what I'm doing. Without further ado, let's just get on with the video. Okay guys, so the first store was Urban Outfitters. What Urban Outfitters is, is basically a very trendy like store. A lot of like teenagers go there. Everyone goes there really, and everything's really overpriced. Basically, like everything is very overpriced, and the only thing, I only got one thing there from Urban, and it was just this creative director jacket. And it looks like this, and I got it oversized. You guys can't even see that, but I mean it's oversized, but like whatever. Basically, it's just this plain jacket hoodie that says creative director and it's tan and it's really big. And this was $98.99, basically $100 just for this one thing. So that's basically all I got at Urban Outfitters because that's all I really like there. Moving on, we went to three different thrift stores, two Goodwills, and then the other one was just like a random thrift shop. Um, and I basically got this whole entire bag. This was from all three stores. Well, the first store we didn't get anything at. We're at the Goodwill right here, so we're gonna walk in, see if we can find anything, and if this one, if we can't find like a lot here, we can go to another one, so let's go. A lot? Oh, that'd be cute if I cropped it. It kind of is. I like the That's actually cute. No, it's not. Yeah, that is. Does it have sleeves? Oh, wait, no, it doesn't. These are like suits. Like shirts like that. Oh, God. And like that, because I can like crop that. And if we can find things like that. And then what I'm, what I'm planning is getting jeans and then cutting the jeans into shorts. So jean shorts. Okay. It's like really cute. You like that? Is there anything on the back? No. That's like a little pot. It's cute. It's cute. But I don't go there. <laughs> this is so weird. On this, I thought it was really cute, but it's like too big. Oh, oh my god, no, it's way too big. But it's really cute. That one was a fail. There was nothing in there. And usually I always find something. So, on to the next one now. Okay, see you at the next one. Okay, moving on to the second store. We got a lot from this store. Um, a lot of basic stuff. And then I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do is basically crop them and make them like super, super trendy or keep them how it is and just like wear them around the house kind of thing. So yeah, this is us going to the second Goodwill store. Down two. Oh, that's kind of cute. Okay, something like that. That would be one cute. Is super cute. I know. Oh my god, it looks like that. Yeah, it kind of does. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna hold this one for now. Yeah. Wait, is hers long sleeve or short sleeve? Okay, so this is everything I got at the second Goodwill location because the first one I didn't find anything and I just didn't want to spend money, like unnecessary money. So the first thing I found was this cute long sleeve black, uh, I don't even, Cassidy, Cassidy Blablasia. Well, please, yeah. Anyways, it looks like this. So what I was picturing doing was cropping this. Oh, and then on the back it has like these like little tribal print things. 
I thought this was really cute. I think this would be cute with shorts, cropped. A really, really good thing to look for if you're going thrift shopping. I didn't even know this until my friend told me this. But basically when you go thrift shopping, they have, when you walk in, they usually have like these. The color blue is 50% off, the color green 70% off. And if you see like these like little tiny tags, that means that it could be like 70% off or 50% off. So if you're on a budget, that's really, really good to look at. Okay, this next shirt I thought was so cute but basically it's this black polo shirt i think it's in a different language <laughs> but it basically looks like this it's like a polo shirt i would say and i'm trying to go for it i think this would be really really cute with either mom jeans i'm gonna cut it but i think it'd be cute with like mom jeans or like really really short high-waisted shorts so yeah that was really cute then i found this other polo this is just um like an actual polo polo. It's really soft too. And it's navy. I'm gonna crop this. And yeah, I'm gonna crop this so it's like light blue too. Next I got just this oversized. I might keep this oversized. Um, I like how there's like a little pocket right here. Um, but it's really, really big, and I thought this would be really, really cute once again with high-waisted, so I might crop this, I might not. But yeah, it's just plain and simple. This one is from Gap, but like at the Goodwill store. So this is really, really oversized too, and it's super, super soft. Like, feel how soft that is. Isn't that really soft? Perfect, like, boyfriend jacket if you don't have a boyfriend. I think I'm gonna rip this up and like make it very, very like worn and vintage looking. Right now we are going to, do you wanna get in? I don't care. Get in. To thrift store number three. How, how much money did we spend? Like $23? 20 20 Like $20, that's all we spent. We've got like six shirts. So we're gonna go to the last store, which is store number three. Kind of far, but and if we can't find anything there, then I mean, this challenge is going to be a bust, but we're gonna try. Number three. <laughs> Okay, now moving on to store number three. I think this was my favorite store for it by far. It was really, really small compared to the second one we went to. I literally thought we wouldn't find anything, but. So the first thing I found, I thought this looked very Urban Outfitters. It's just like this little cassette shirt. It's really big. So I don't know, I don't think I'm gonna crop it just because like I, I like it a lot like this. I was thinking this with oversized jeans. But yeah, it says be a hero, run for a kid with like a little cassette player. I love this shirt like a lot. I feel like you could actually find that at Urban Outfitters, you know? Moving on, I found this. This was just, oh wait, what is this from Yale? I don't know what school this is. Maybe it's Yale, I don't really know. But I'm thinking of cropping this and ripping it all up so it looks very worn and more expensive than it actually was. Cause this goes down basically to my knee or mid thigh. So I'm definitely cropping this. Okay, so then this, I could not believe I found because I found a picture, I'm gonna insert it right here. This was like my inspo picture for a jacket like this. So I got this jacket right here and it kind of looks like the picture, but not really. But I just think this would be really, really cute with like leggings. Then I got, these I could not believe I found. These are really big on me, but I'm gonna like shrink them and put a belt and maybe even make these into shorts if being crafty. I don't know, but they're Levi's basically. That's why I bought them. If they weren't Levi's, then I probably wouldn't have gotten them. They're only $7.99. $7.99 for Levi's. That's crazy. Um, or I might just cuff the bottoms and make them into mom jeans and cut them all up. I haven't decided yet. Leave a comment down below if I should do shorts or make them into mom jeans. Then the final thing I got at the thrift store. I've been wanting a real leather jacket and this one was $29.99 
but I don't think she rang it up as $29.99. I think she scanned it as like $5.99 or maybe $9.99. The total was like $35 at that store, and that just doesn't add up. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. If you guys want to see um, a video on how to make the stuff I got at Goodwill, like very trendy, basically what they sell at Urban Outfitters, let me know and I will definitely do that video. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.